Well, two months into the Russian invasion of Ukraine, Putin's troops have left. Some of the major cities in shambles. Let's take you through all the defining images that have shocked the world as the war enters day 59. The haunting images on your screen are from the Donetsk region of Ukraine. Footage captures the regional trauma hospital in the town of Liman that has been shelled, leaving it in ruins. Fine and plumes of smoke can be seen from the collapsed and shattered buildings there. The port city of Maripol has fallen. Drone images capture the aftermath of relentless Russian shelling and airstrikes. Several high-rise buildings, shopping centers and property are in ruins. Horrific pictures are from the besieged port city of Maripol. Ukrainians can be seen carrying bodies of their relatives who lost their lives due to the war, the human cost of the war. Images are from the ghost town of Bucha that faced the most horrific massacre by Russian troops. Images captured Russian shells being demined. These images are from the port city of Maripol. Walls and interiors of the house completely collapsed and in ruins. Russia continues to fight to take over Ukrainian city of Kharkiv. Our correspondent Mosmi Singh brings you this report on the 59th day of this war. This is the kind of crater that has uh, erupted on the depression that you see on the earth. Uh, the entire rocket uh, falling here. The entire scene here is pretty scary. Even houses have been, uh, buildings have not been spared. And um, all that you see, the colors of life gone, colors of rust, gray and black is what prevails on uh, even as Kharkiv remains on the edge. Shelling continues in Kharkiv. Empty buildings stand with black smear from shelling. All important structures of the city have been targeted. Where we are right now in this debris is buried the boxing ring of this uh, sporting facility. From the basketball court to the several facilities have been completely, uh, you know, buried in the debris. And perhaps every iconic building, every important infrastructure is being targeted here you can see that this is the this is the mask. You can see the face shield of the boxers. We've seen several items here. You can see that how the entire boxing ring and uh, the punching bags are uh, surrounded by debris. The entire terrace has been uh, blown apart. In the midst of the war, India today met two friends standing guard of their country to defend the land they love. So here you are, Poma and Cuba, both are buddies, both are partners.
for life in this uh, war. They are the defenders of their land. They are from the territorial army of Kharkiv, the brave soldiers showing you uh, the victory sign. And uh, this is a war that's going on for weeks and days, but they are not tired. They're all set and ready to challenge the enemy every day. And where we are standing, they're shelling every three hours. Uh, if pictures will tell you the story, this destruction, uh, the bombings of buildings is continuing in this area, which is very close to the front line. And Puma and Cuba have been at it, uh, you know, defending this particular territory. Uh, they say that we hear shelling all the time and there is no time when they actually rest. With video journalist Parminder Sharma and Mosmi Singh reporting from Kharkiv, Bureau Report, India Today.